Hello everybody, Diffuse Maverick here, and welcome back. Today we're going to be doing something a little different, something I actually haven't done in a long time. A tutorial. Now, in this tutorial, as you may see from the title, this is going to be a tutorial to fix an issue with Adobe Premiere Pro. Well, not necessarily a fix, but it's more of a workaround, so therefore basically a fix. Now, this is a audio desync issue, bug fix, whatever you want to call it. And I'm going to show you and demonstrate if if you're just watching this video purely for entertainment purposes, there's not going to be any boobs. Now, moving on, go into our test project, and once it loads, I'm going to show you what issue I'm talking about, or if, of course, this issue is having to you, happening to you, then you know exactly what I'm talking about, and if you want to, you can probably just skip ahead. So, that's the wrong area. So, basically, let's select this file right here. Load that up, throw it into our timeline, blah. I've been doing this for about eight hours today, so I know exactly where to go to get a good demonstration and figure out on uh, where I should be, basically. And it's, it's Fallout 4. Spoilers, everybody. This is a non-pivotal point in the story. But it's a good pivotal point for our example. Now just listen to the audio here. He shoots our wife, and he shoots her again. But, as you can see, he only shot her once. So, yeah. Let's watch the shot again. There's the gunshots. Audio is out of sync, basically. You get the idea. So, what we're going to do here is I'm going to show you how to fix this issue. Let's take this out. Cut that out, and we're going to go to control panel, and in control panel go to appearance and customizations, you'll want to go to file explorer options, and then in this window hit view. Once you're in view, you'll see hide extensions from known file types. Now this is on Windows 10, if you're using another operating system, this is the same process. I watched another video through my 8 hour journey today. And basically, unclick that, or uncheck that rather. What this allows you to do, is it allows you to see uh, what the extension is for the different file types of videos that you may have. So... We'll go to uh, our Fallout 4 stuff here. And as you can see, this will be the extension right here. When that thing is checked, this doesn't appear whatsoever. So what we're going to do is we're going to make a folder. Purely for our example purposes and showing you guys on how to fix this issue. Name it test. I know caps are on. And we're not going to just directly put that in there and do anything with it, no. So we don't fuck anything up. We're just going to make a copy. And I suggest you guys do the same exact thing. Because if you fuck up and delete it, and it's gone, and who knows how many hours of recording or how long of recording you might have had, it's gone. So we're going to skip ahead here. I'll be right back. Oh my god, we're almost done. And... We are done. Okay. So, there's our copy. And what we are going to do here is we're going to rename this to something else. A different file format. Now, basically how I did this is while in Premiere Pro... You'll just want to bring up your file, 
go down to import this is how I figured out um, the supported file types basically open that up and I use this to literally go through a lot of different extensions basically and um, I just kept going through and some weird stuff happened when I was doing so because on some of these extensions uh, the video like either got longer extremely short didn't show up said it was damaged at one point I don't know it's the same file I was working with I just kept changing the extension and finally I got it right now like I said I watched another video before on this and he used dot mov for his extension that didn't work for me that's the one that extended the video link for me and slowed down the audio well not really slowed down the audio the audio played at the same rate but basically the video was extended for like 10 or 20 seconds or whatever but what worked for me was down on quicktime movie dot diff and yes I did choose this purely because DIF my gamer tag slash YouTube name diffuse maverick diff whatever that's why I chose it and you will see what's fixing to happen here so you want to right click hit rename and then change that to whatever you finally find that actually works for you because I don't know if it will work for you or not it works for me because things are just different for everybody so this will pop up just hit yes and then select it so it's in your file name right here hit open and then you'll just throw it into your timeline click on that extend that get all the way back that way we know what time we skip ahead to which is roughly about eight minutes like i said i've gone through this a lot today and i want to decrease the burden on you guys As we play through our annoying child crying, you'll see what happens here. Wait for it. And as you can see, ladies and gentlemen, the video is in fact in sync. Again, this is for me on the extension that worked for me. It will most likely or could not be different for you. I don't know. But for me, that's what works. Hope you guys have enjoyed this video. If you didn't, well, screw you. If you did enjoy this video, please hit the like button. And if you want to, subscribe. I won't be making too many tutorial videos like these at all this is like an occasional thing basically but I will continue with my fallout adventure video that you last saw and also I'm thinking about uh, making more of the halo weapon history videos like the m6 magnum pistol so that's a cool thing till next time see you guys later